three-year-old male presenting for two to three days of gradual uptendation. On the axial flare sequence, there is abnormal hyperintensity in the supracellar ambient and interpeduncular cisterns. There is also mild hydrocephalus with dilatation of the temporal horns. The axial T2 and susceptibility weighted images demonstrate abnormal hypointense signal in the prepontine space and extending towards the right cerebellopontine angle cistern. The post contrast sagittal T1 weighted image re demonstrates hemorrhage in the prepontine and premedullary spaces. The 3D maximal intensity projection reconstructions from the 3D time of flight MRA images of the head demonstrate smooth concentric mark narrowing of the distal vertebral arteries vertebral confluence, and proximal basal artery. The imaging findings are compatible with vasospasm in the setting of acute subarachnoid hemorrhage. Cerebral vasospasm is a major source of morbidity and mortality in the setting of acute subarachnoid hemorrhage. Vasospasm can be seen between 40 to 70 percent of cases of subarachnoid hemorrhage. Symptoms typically are present from four to 10 days following the hemorrhage.